Missouri and Kansas electors have already placed their ballots, and Kansas electors unanimously voted for President-elect Donald Trump. However, over a dozen protesters booed and shouted at them following the results. 41 Action News reporter Tom Dempsey witnessed the vote and explains what happened inside the Senate chamber. Well, things have since quieted down here inside the Kansas Senate chamber, but earlier today, all six Kansas electors placed their votes, many of them sitting in the front row of those desks right there. That was before angry shouts rained down from above. The result of the vote is six votes for Donald J. Donald J. Trump for President of the United States. Over a dozen protesters shouted shame and blood on your hands following the six to nothing electoral college vote here in Topeka. The vote followed calls from around the country for the electors to change their vote. Some of the Kansas electors say they received over a hundred thousand emails from voters asking them to not vote for Donald Trump. But in the end, they say they stuck with the majority of voters who showed support for President elect Trump in the election. It's been a lot of stress on, uh, you know, on your email system on your family um, but this is my third time voting for Donald Trump and I was happy to do it today oh I had I had no hesitation in placing the vote the only thing I wanted to make sure was that I, I signed the right box and put put the right check mark in the right box vice president-elect Mike Pence also received six electoral votes today this marks the 13th straight time a Republican candidate has won the state of Kansas in the presidential election in Topeka Tom Dempsey 41 action news Missouri's 10 Republican electors all voted for president-elect Donald Trump today as well.